family tradition, the third annual Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular at Iroquois Park. WLKY's Morgan Lintus gives us a behind-the-scenes look at what it takes to put on this spectacular show. Normally a sculptor, but uh, this is an awesome way that I get to, to use my my knowledge. In. Whether it's carving an image of Steve McQueen. Kind of looks like the rebel without a cause cover. Or depicting the piercing eyes of a baboon. It's an art that has drawn a crowd of thousands for a family event that is truly illuminating. This is a linoleum block print carving tool. And we just kind of use it for, uh, for pumpkinos. More than 5,000 carved and lit pumpkins will illuminate the quarter mile walking trail in Iroquois Park. The pumpkins show the true artistry of their creators, who are just as unique and diverse as the pumpkins they carve. My name is David. Um, I've always been involved in art in general. Um, I have a degree from Murray State at Studio Art. For months, artists with a passion for pumpkins are in this studio as they carve, create, and prepare each jack o' lantern. Take this to the dark room, make sure everything glows really nice, and uh, see if there's anything I have to touch up on it. At this point, it almost feels more like a sculpture than a drawing, just because it's more, more hands-on. Yeah, so I'm just going to go in here and, and brighten this edge up, make it, uh, make it pop out a little bit more. Yeah, so honestly, uh, pretty happy with it. And the process is nonstop for the duration of the event. Each jack-o'-lantern design is carved several times on a new pumpkin and then replaces a pumpkin on the trail so the pumpkins always look their best. So it's around the clock, uh, people drawing, painting, carving, um, and it's, it's just started. This year's theme is The World is a Stage, and it's set to music. You'll see artists, actors, heroes, villains, and even a historical landmark or two. It will have a little something for everyone. Instead of putting an image on a pumpkin, we turn the pumpkin into an image. The, the woods has a presence of its own. You know, to walk through the woods at night is it's just a magical, creepy thing. All right, Morgan Lintus reporting. The event starts tonight at dusk and runs until 11 p.m. 90,000 people are expected to attend this year. You can buy tickets in advance at the Iroquois Amphitheater box office or log on to WLKY.com for a link.